Welcome back to the channel, everyone. All right, here we go. It's time to feed the blood parrots. Approaching the tank here right now. As you can see, <laughs> they still have a tendency to get pretty shy. They startle pretty easily. It's amazing how many of them fit into that pyramid right there. And <laughs> there goes another one swimming in there. So what's in store for today? Some cichlid crisps and some pellets. The shrimp pellets. They love this, let me tell you. A little bit nervous right now. It's funny because when one of them gets scared, they all get scared. And something kind of prehistoric activates in their brain until they finally realize, wait a second, the coast is clear. That's food about to come into our tank. And then once one of them thinks it's safe, they all do. And then, of course, when there's food in the water, they basically forget about everything. <laughs> when it's chow time, that's all that matters. And you know what? I'll tell you something. It's pretty cool to switch up what you feed them because I think it's their most favorite part of the day. They really enjoy, you know, chow time. And if you mix it up, let's see if someone knocks this out of my hand. They're bit taking a little bit longer than normal. But especially with the clear spoon, they know what to do. They're going to knock it right out of my hand. And no matter what, it ends up startling me because you never know when it's going to happen. Actually, I think that was one of the little ones. One of the little ones, which I haven't named yet. Knocked that free, jarred it loose, and knocked all the pellets into the water. You saw the treto swim away there. That that treto is incredibly quick. It's almost unbelievable when he gets startled how quickly he just blinks to the other side of the aquarium or behind some cover. So everyone is munching here on those pellets. They love those things. Even the little ones can handle them. They soften up when they're in the water for a few seconds and they can handle chewing those. Now we're going to add the Tetra Cichlid Crisps. It's another easy to to chew and eat food. They're a little bit nervous again for some reason. Like I said, when one of them is nervous, it kind of triggers all of them to think that they're supposed to hide from something. But as soon as they see that food, they know it's time and then they're not gonna be so cautious because they think about their belly <laughs> more than anything else. So here they go, got a kind of a cool shot right here, looking at the top of the water from under. And I give a pretty generous portion. You know, blood parrots are big eaters. I do feed them every other day, though. But I tend to feed them more during the holidays. I'll tend to just think it should be a holiday for them as well. You know, Christmas, Thanksgiving time. I'll feed them two or three days in a row. But it is easier on your maintenance if you go every other day and the fish will be fine. And, you know, keeps the water a little cleaner. So everyone is continuing to thrive in this tank. Like and subscribe, please, to the channel if you haven't. Hit the alert bell so you don't miss any of the videos. And please comment below. I love to read the comments. I check for them all the time. We'll see you again soon. Thank you.